what's going on collectors optical 20 back for another video preview today we're going to take a look at aragorn the battle of helm's leap version from two towers and you can pre-order this figure at bigbadtoystore.com just the regular version the deluxe you can head over to the asmus website or uh through sideshow and i'll put the link down below it is a must have for me he is my missing piece in my lord of the rings collection and it's aragorn the basically the biggest star of the entire trilogy so definitely i'm gonna get it would i recommend which version do i recommend i would say if you're not a hardcore fan you can settle for the regular version the 195 it is arguably the better head sculpt out of the two uh so the 295 so basically for what 90 dollars you are paying a head sculpt this straight looking head sculpt which is not that great and a beautiful backdrop now i'm i'm leaning towards that diorama because i, I can just see myself using that in so many photo ops uh, it is huge so if you don't have the space to display it I you know I recommend staying away from it and save yourself $90 however for me uh, who does photography and, and I'm, I'm you know planning this new video for every other my figure uh, that would be beneficial however I can it's 280 so it's it's almost the price of a hot toys not almost it's a price of a hot toy so I can see some hesitant uh, folks out there who, who want to pull back for the 280 but for the regular version 195 is a good price that is like three zero category um but you know you get this you know it's still a beautiful figure the outfit you can't really uh knock asmos for that although this is not that intricate compared to like aomir and and elrond you know it doesn't have an armor so it's it's pretty uh easy it's chain mail and and it looks like his gauntlet is has been reused uh as well so as far as the outfit but uh, aragorn you know i missed out on the slim version which is 175 back in the day and that was rooted hair so i don't know it seems like for me initially with this head sculpt it was a step back because i actually do like that slim version regardless of the look um but rooted hair is almost you know if you do it right it's better than sculpted hair now i don't know if it's gonna work out for this it, it, it i didn't have any problems with the slim version when i saw it but yeah it's more expensive and less rooted you know I, he got bloody hands in here but i don't know but again if you don't have any Asmus or, or Aragorn in your collection and you really wanted one, then 195 is still not a bad price. You know, I've seen third party figures that are more expensive than this guy. Um, is it a must have? If you're a casual fan, maybe you can skip on it. I can see them doing another version of Aragorn, maybe the, uh, you know, the um, Return of the King version. Although this is, I love this movie, The Two Towers. Arguably, for me, this is the best movie out of the trilogy. So, I'm going to get it. You know what? I'm going to get any Aragorn looking uh, Asmus figure, to be quite honest with you, regardless of the head sculpt. But I was just a little disappointed because they're doing so good, you know, with Elrond and um, Gimli and, and the other figures. And I felt like they did a step back, but it, it's still pretty good. So let me know what you guys think on the comments down below. Please subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in the next video.